Welcome to another Phys Ed Minor Games video. The game we're going to be looking at today is called Footy Grenades. Now, the equipment you're going to need for Footy Grenades is ideally around about 12 footballs, and you'll also need four cones per team, so depending on how many teams you're going to have set up. Now, played out on a field or on a football oval, you can see here we've set up the field for four teams, so just using the four cones per team, we've set up a square for each team, around about, say, 10 by 10 the area and that's probably not a bad start and you can alter that to make it bigger or smaller as you decide so you can see here you'll evenly spread your players amongst those teams so after you pick your sides you send them towards their team area and then you can tell them who they're playing against so you can see here the blue are playing the yellow and the red are playing the blue you can then change it up later on so the yellow's playing blue red's playing blue and so on or you can have so they're kicking on the diagonal so the yellow are taking on the red and the dark blues are taking on the light blues or if you want you can actually have a free for all where you don't tell them who they're playing and they can basically kick the balls in whatever direction they want to kick them but if you found okay there's not much maximum participation so there's a fair bit of standing around if you wanted to you could actually change it so you can have six teams probably easiest if you're playing across from each other say the blue would play the yellows red would play the light blues and so on now just for the ease of explaining the game, we'll start off just with two teams. So we've got the red team taking on the blue team. So we've got three players per team. And when I'm starting off this game, I always just start with one ball, just so they get the understanding of how the game works. Now, it does work more effectively if it's more structured. So if you tell your players, OK, you're only allowed to kick when I yell out, go, or kick. Or if you want, you can say, until you hear the double whistle, you don't kick, and so on. So... We'll show it here, so if I was, as a teacher I would yell at, okay, ready, set, go, and the players with the ball kick the ball into the opposing team's area, and they try to mark it. So the storyline I always tell them is, okay, you're in your trenches, the footballs are grenades, so you've got to make sure you don't let the grenade land inside your trench. So if it lands inside your trench, you get a penalty point, and it's a team with a lower score, they're the winners. So again, when they're ready, I'd say, okay, ready, set, kick, they kick the ball into the opposing team's area and again the red team have marked theirs but the blue team dropped theirs and it actually landed inside their area so therefore the blue team would pick up a penalty point so they chase the ball up get it ready and go again now just a couple of things you need to make sure that you're rotating your kickers so you need to have a rule that might be you can't kick twice in a row and if one or two players are dominating they're marking everything you might say okay that's fantastic Jess you're doing really well but now if you're marking you have to mark it one handed or if they're just beginning you'll have to mark it overhead instead of chess marking and so on okay so we'll show it here if you found okay yep they've got a good understanding of how the game's played instead of using one ball per team you can then increase it so that each team starts with two balls same rules apply ready set kick they kick the balls out into the field and they've all been successfully marked okay so you then say ready set kick again they kick the ball into the opposing trench and you can see here the red have taken theirs but the blue team they didn't cover their area very well and the ball landed inside therefore they'd pick up a penalty point that's how you play footy grenades for more minor game ideas or resources head to phyzetta.com.au or subscribe to the phyzetta youtube channel thanks a lot